everybody, I'm Jason Ritchie, and uh, I'm here to give you a lesson in uh, what another lesson in what I would call vamping. Okay, what you do is you get yourself a little lick. You can get this lick from doing your scale exercises like which you can get in some of my other videos. Or you just hear a cool little lick in your head or anything. You can take a traditional vamp that's already been done like Muddy Waters, I'm a man. <laughs> okay, or anything, right? But what I'm here to talk to you about is get a little vamp going. Now, one of the first ones that I got was just this kind of like shortening bread. What I'm doing is two draw, two blow, one draw, two blow. But I'm trying, making sure and putting a rhythm to it, like the dun dun dun. Boom, 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 applying that shuffle drum beat. Da -doom, da -doom, da -doom, da -doom. Now I'm not tongue, tongue blocking it, but I'm playing it as if I was. I can actually tongue block it and sound like I like a little more slap. Which I could do if I was a better tongue blocker, maybe even. But anyway, that's how I do it. But then anyway, you throw in a little riff, and you usually throw it in on the downbeat. By down mean I mean a one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one on the downbeat. Ready? So. You know, anything, really, jazzy, bluesy, country, it doesn't matter. As long as it's in major key, because that's what we're kind of doing. You can get a little minor on there. So you get a little vamp going. It could be any vamp, you know. Just gonna make one up. I'm incorporating chord changes in this one by playing the four and the five, which would be in uh, which you can find under my videos called root notes, where I explain that. But basically, just a vamp. I don't really like this one, but I'll go off of it because I used it. making it up but see here today I'm coming back to this theme it's a good way to practice and like and try to work in the licks that you've been learning now again it's not even really about the licks I mean the licks are important and you want to perfect them but it's really about the timing and getting this inner jam going you know Gus is really good at it he gets it behind Satan all the time Kim gets it got it behind Jimmy Rogers on that one album on that Ludella yeah, but, you know, Walter did it behind all those guys. But, like, you know, just getting into that little groove, you know, and you can set that groove for yourself with a little vamp, you know. Adam's the king of them. He's got a million. But there's tons of guys. Alan Wilson, 
great at vamping behind the hook on the hooker and heat record. All that stuff's great, man. Just get a little vibe going, get a little jam going, and then just improvise. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> 